Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Steven for those of you that don't know and today we're going to be reacting to the Grounded 1.0 dev blog. We're going to look at my base and trigger warning, lots of spiders. Let's get into it. It's time to go big or never go home. So many new things. Available now. We did it! We made it through game preview, everyone. If you Yay. haven't yet, congratulate yourself for getting us to this 1.0 launch. My name is Shyla, and I'm here Hi, with Shyla. your full release vlog. Perfect. So now let's get this party let's started. Let's talk about some things. Since the start of your time in the backyard, there have been some questions we've all wanted answers to. Why are we so tiny? How did seriously, we wind up in this backyard? Nah, seriously who did though. This to us? Well, no, we know who did it. The scientist did it. I know These that for sure. And more will be I know that for sure. Playing through the story now available and grounded. You will now expose the mysteries surrounding your existence and hopefully by using this new knowledge, you will be able to go big and go home. Oh damn, the we're going to go home. Like to take this time to let you know that while we have reset story quest and content for this full game release, your bases, recipes, and other unlocks have been carried over. So please do not be alarmed. Literally, thank you for that. Because I did start again. And like, I started at the case. And I was a little bit worried. But when I ran back over to my base, it was still there. Everything's fine. Thank you, Obsidian Entertainment, for keeping my base and shit. Because it's 200 hours of work that would have just been gone. When you hop it's into your gone. And, save and find that you are now back at the starting location. This has been done to help prevent any issues, but you should be able to run directly to where you left your base and carry on. And also, the milk molar unlocks have been refunded, so you can reallocate them due to all the new addition this release brings. Perfect. Okay. So, the new area, as far as I'm aware, now we can't is the call eastern this upper the area. most yeah. significant update ever without adding some new areas for you and your friends to go explore. Areas such as the entire eastern upper yard, a vast, sprawling wildland yeah, full of towering household there. items, and new angry bugs. Don't worry, we'll get to the new neighbors soon. You'll be able to explore a brand new tunnel system, hey. admire the new pretty flora, and discover some resources for you to use. Along with the eastern upper yard, you will now be able to find new secret labs that will I love that they did the redacted. You have to actually go find the labs, but we know a few of them, like the stump lab, and we have to go back to the original labs, which all of the stuff has been reset. So that's nice. And you may also notice that some of the existing labs and secrets have now been... It's cute. But it's that's cute not when they all. do that. There's an area for you to find where the mystery of the backyard continues. For those achievement hunters out there, fear not, because we have not forgotten you. This full release I'm comes complete with hunter. nine new achievements for you to seek out. And six new mutations can also be discovered while playing the game. And when you hop in, you will also notice that the glider slot is now the accessory slot. What are these accessories? We have now added trinkets to the game, which you can equip, that will give you special bonuses and status effects. To help you with Sounds your time in the awesome, backyard. You can but I probably will never find them. By locating some unique ones in the yard. Or maybe you'll get lucky and they will appear as a loot drop. It is important to remember that your dandelion tufts will need to be equipped in the accessory slot to help prevent you from falling to your death. In terms of item management, you'll notice that we included some spiffy things to help you stay organized. For example, items will now remember what slot they were last this is literally the biggest change that I needed because I die a lot. I, I play solo, so I die a lot. And then I have to go pick up my bag and then it's never organized and I hate it. And now it is and I love it. Thank you. When being added Thank back you. to your backpack via re-equipping or picking up a death backpack. In addition, you'll now be able to hot deposit to all nearby storage containers. That is nice. Which could be done using the, well, the new hot deposit nearby storage action which I think is the best name for this feature. We've added the ability nice. to adjust the size and opacity of the reticle through the options menu, and we have decreased the amount of time it takes you to chop down weeds. Thank Some changes God. to the milk molar system have also been applied. 
like combining the hunger drain and thirst good it made no sense single it literally made no sense why it was hunger drain and then thirst drain like it should have just been them both purchase upgrade we've also added a new personal upgrade called the healing and the more this upgrade increases the more health you will receive from healing items and Perfect. this is excellent news for those of you like myself who like to charge into battle and forget to block and That's rely me. on these healing items to survive finally mega milk molar stack size upgrades have been increased from three to five nice Around this section off we have added three new super mixers to the upper yard which are Bruh. the regular mixers that are there i already have a trouble with now they're super mixers i can't i can't i'm sorry i'm not good enough more raw signs when completed when it comes to new crafting content i'm sorry this i'm just not good enough oodles of new items for you including a new weapon type staffs you can yeah, i'm about to be a wizard i'm about to be a spicy wizard just upgrade my spicy staff and just pew 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 now craft staves at a different candy shards you'll find in the yard it's gonna be fun. each with its own unique attack style i don't want you can sour craft three different types in total but it will be up to you to figure out what they are we already Not know like that, sour mint and a new candy um, flavor sour mint and spicy sour you can unlock this unique flavor by locating and harvesting everybody's favorite candy wormholes i've never heard of that candy i know this game's from the like 80s or 90s i've never heard of that candy for the rest of the crafting content please enjoy this spiffy video montage that will quickly go over some of the new content you'll be able to craft with this full release i want her that mask. I need that mask and the chest plate and the knee caps. Like, I, I love them. It's, they are great. You can have a barbarian helmet. I don't know what those shin pads are supposed to be. I think that that head is a spider hat. That's cool. Weapons. The save. The tiger mosquitoes. Part of what has made this journey in the backyard so special is this process has allowed us to come together to make the improvements needed to make the backyard a fantastic place for all of us to play in. Using the feedback we have received, we have gone through to make some adjustments to the weapon and armor upgrade system. Oh. You will first notice that stones of toughness and rocks of style have been renamed to quartzite and marble. Why? Additionally, literally why they were fine Tough nuggets and style nuggets have been renamed to quartzite shards and marble shards the tier name convention has been changed from na cool rad to brittle sturdy supreme okay. and an additional crafting step has been added to the weapon armor upgrade process why just to annoy us now we've got to make wheat stones and plating where you now must process the quartzite and marble into whetstones and armor plating before using. Also, At least it only takes one. Tier 3 crafting recipes for creating supreme materials have been added to the game. So go forth and unlock and become the supreme beings we know you all to be. That was cute. I liked that. That was amazing. I will try to be the supreme being that you know me to be, but you know, it's hard. It's kind of hard. Finally, you know we can't end this vlog without introducing you to some fabulous new neighbors <laughs> you'll encounter as Excuse you continue me. to play. For starters, we know how much mosquitoes. you all love mosquitoes. Yeah, so totally. With this update, we are introducing to you the tiger mosquito because it's why just not? Skin. Not only that, but we know how much y'all love spiders. Every no. stream, we get asked, when are we adding more? Every no. post that goes out. We see you, our community, asking no. for more spiders. So we've delivered, and you will no. now find a black widow no. and black widowling. No. Just because we want to make no. you happy. Some no. other new neighbors no. include the moth, spiky water food, moth, ticks, worker fire ants, fire ants. soldier fire ants, and the beautiful pink orchid mantis. I will that I'm never sure you fight this all bitch. Seen I will literally never get to her. She is amazing, and I would love to. I don't think that I will. We've I'm also going to try. I'm going to try. But who or what they are? 
is for you to uncover. So go find them and say hi. No, thank Before you. This vlog, thank I you, share the Obsidian news that you Entertainment. You are an amazing company. You make an amazing game. And I'm sure that it's just going to get better and better as time goes on. So honestly, just thank you for keeping all my stuff. And now, we're going to try, keyword being try, to show off my bases, do a little tour, and then maybe go fight the brood mother and the mantis boss. It probably won't go well, but I'm going to try. You know, what's the worst that happens? I die. It's just a game. It's just a game. We got this. We got this. Don't judge me. Because 250 days is hell. It's been a while. I like this game. I'm sure people have higher ones. All right. So this is the purple house. You start over there somewhere and you come up here and there's a rock and I built my first house here. We have an elevator that sometimes works, sometimes doesn't. We'll see what happens. Hey, it's working. Okay, sweet. Now. Over there is the haze, which the reset turned it back on, which is great, because infected were everywhere, and I did not like it. That's the picnic bench, and that's the shed. That's the pond, so that's the new eastern upper yard. So we need to go over to our oak tree home. That is the oak tree. It has many resources. It has many resources. I do play a lot of solo, so... Sorry that things are not super organized. But I just... It's so much to move around and build by yourself. It's just a pile of chests. And so, this is my crafting station. And yes, it's literally just a pile of chests and a workbench. Maybe I'll organize it one day, but right now, it's just not top priority. We want to set our respawn point here. And then we want to go over here. This is my lookout. I built it for me and my friends, even though I have no friends that play this game. I have like a few, just they don't play often. That is the crow. Gives you great feathers for this crow crossbow. But yeah, so that's the pond, and that's the new eastern upper yard. But I don't think I can just go there. I'm pretty sure I have to do the story again. So that way it unlocks everything. Showtime! Showtime! Ha <laughs> ha! Just like laser tag! Yeah. Here we go. Had to get the angle right. It is nice to see a how can I help you today? Huh. You made it back in one piece. I wanna catch you. Is this the right way? Yeah, close enough. Red Ant Hill is easy, because I have red ant armor, so they don't bother me. 
As long as I don't bother them, they don't bother me. And that's how we like it. taking your food. I ain't taking your eggs. I'm just here for the burger chip. Many ants. This is why you wear ant armor. I ain't fighting none of them. Full set of ant armor. Ants ignore you. Wonder if the fire ants do that. Hi, right, Burgle. We have a chip for you. Got the hedge rod chip for you. No, the red ant lot. The red ant hill chip this time. It is nice to see. How can I help you? Ah. Aha! Bro, oh, science! Scabby. Additional flavor scheme available. Now that I can make the BLT, we go home and make it. Fuck you, bitch. So that was great. That was great. I haven't killed the brood mother, so I have to do that. And then I gotta kill the mantis. Before I can even get there, though, I have to go back into the black ant hill, kill the assistant manager. There's a lot to do. There's a lot to do, and I have to get the wood pile chip in order to get the staffs. I, I still want to do a lot, but you know, when you're by yourself, things are not always that easy. Things are time consuming. Hopefully I'll make a second part of this video where I show off my finished base, but it might take a few weeks cause like organization. Anyway, if it wasn't for all the spiders, it would be a nine out of 10, but I've got to say 8.5 out of 10 cause there's just so many spiders and it's terrifying, but it's fine. It's a great game. I love it. 40 usd on steam it's also on xbox don't think it's on playstation but obsidian entertainment you made a marvelous game be sure to leave a like if you like the video and subscribe if you want to see more content of me you know i react to things i play some games do some reviews we'll see what else i can get up to thanks again